So the next thing we're gonna to do today, we're gonna to do one of our worksheets. You should have this in your folder and we're working on number seven. And it says count the ants at the picnic and color the picnic basket. So we're gonna count the ants. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Ants are not something you want at your picnic, but in this picture, they put them in there. So we have to hope they don't eat our sandwich, our banana, or our juice. So now we're gonna color the picnic basket. I'm gonna go with brown, but you could choose another color if you like, but I'm gonna color mine brown. So I hope all of y'all are doing your work at home and everything's going well and y'all are all feeling well. And when we come back, it's gonna remind, we gotta remind our mom and dad we must wear our mask at all times when we come back. So we're all going to work on that to make sure we bring our mask every day. You could put, pack an extra one in your backpack. So I'm coloring my, ma my basket, not the mask. But don't forget your mask. So I'm almost finished. I guess I could have gotten yellow for the banana, but y'all could do that at home. Color your banana and your juice box whatever color you would like to color it. But let's count the ants one more time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Number seven. And you can try to write your name right there. We're also still doing rectangles. So I'm gonna do the red for my rectangle. So y'all can see the rectangle. You can color the whole picture, but I'm just gonna color the rectangle part. So these, these remember, two short, short side, Short side, two short ones and two long. That's what makes it different from a square. A square would be all the same size. These are too long, too long, too short. So you can finish color in your picture if you like. Next, we're going to read a book. We're gonna do jungle animals. Hmm. There are, wait, I think I missed a page. Jungle animals. There are lots of animals in this picture. Point to all the different animals. A zebra, elephant, a crocodile, a parrot, hippo, lion, monkey, a snake, and a giraffe. I think I got them all. All these animals live in the jungle or close by. A lion, a zebra, we use him when we do our alphabet. An elephant, we also use elephant too. A snake, a monkey, a giraffe, crocodile, hippopotamus, and parrot. It says to say each one's name out loud, which I did do. I see one green. Ah, oh, parrot has a little green on him too. A daddy lion has long fur around his face. It's called a mane. Point to the daddy lion. That's the daddy lion. A mommy lion is called a lioness. Point to the mommy lion. And how many babies? One, two, three, four. That one's playing. They're all playing. A parrot has bright, colorful feathers. Point to a red parrot in the picture. Hmm, let me see. Do I see a red one? Hmm, right there. And can I find a blue parrot? See him on the tree. And look, if you look really close, there's a snake hiding in the, on the trunk. Hope he's not trying to get those birds. Snap, snap. These crocodiles have big, strong jaws and sharp teeth. Two crocodiles. Can you make your arms snap like a crocodile's jaws? Try it. An elephant's nose is called a trunk. Look at it. What are these elephants doing? They are using their trunks to squirt the water. Look, they're giving each other a bath. That would be fun. Zebras have lots of black and white stripes. Can you spot another striped animal in the picture? I see it down here, a snake. Can you find a creature with spots? Hmm. A butterfly has spots. So stripes, stripes, and some spots. These playful monkeys love to jump, swing, and climb in the tall trees. Look at them. They're swinging on the vines. Try to act like a playful monkey. You do that. <laughs> 
Giraffes have long necks and legs to keep them, to help them reach the leaves on the trees. So they get to eat all the tall trees. I guess they could lean down and eat some of the shorter ones. Let's see how many giraffes they have in this picture. One, two, three, four, five, one little baby. Pretend to be a tall giraffe and stretch up as high as you can. Snakes have no arms or legs. They slide and slither along the ground and they make the sss sound. How many snakes can you spot in this picture? Point to each one. One, two, three, four, five. I don't see any other ones. Well, six counting that one. Hippopotamuses are very big. This hippo is bathing in a pond to keep cool. Point to a small creature in the picture. Mm, let's spy. What do we spy? A tiny frog. He's very small compared to the hippo. He's very large. Can you make a noise like each of these each of these jungle animals? A lion would roar. A bird would squawk. A elephant would trump. Sorry, Kim, not good at sounds. Make each noise as loud as you can. Hiss. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Snap. Which jungle animal is your favorite? The end.